When Apple's online store goes down, it's normally a hint of something new, and the internet goes bananas. This time was weird because we weren't expecting any major announcements from Apple ahead of its Showtime event next week. But down it went this morning, and when the store came back, we were greeted with two new iPads, including one that has gone four long years without an update. First up, there's a bigger 10.5 inch iPad Air with an upgraded A12 Bionic processor and first generation Apple Pencil support to boot. Prices start at $499, with a cellular model priced at $629. And then there's the iPad Mini. It's been a long time coming, but four years on, we're getting a substantially improved version of the tiny tablet, with a 7.9 inch screen that's 25% brighter than the iPad Mini 4. Apple Pencil support is also on board here, which Apple boss Tim Cook took to Twitter to show off. The new iPad Mini starts at $399 for the Wi Fi model, while adding cellular will cost $529. Both devices are available online at Apple right now. It's exciting to see both iPad families get a 2019 makeover, but compared to the iPad Pro redesign, these refreshes are a little more conservative. And let's remember, Apple chose to sneak its iPads out with little fanfare. Its upcoming press event in Cupertino increasingly sounds like it'll be almost entirely dedicated to new video streaming and new subscriptions. The company knows services are one of its major growth areas, especially as we're buying fewer phones and tablets. That said, we'd still like to hear about those next-gen AirPods, please. We'll see you tomorrow with more Engadget Today.